Mastering MLA, in text citations unveiled. Hello, dear learners. Today, we're diving into the world of MLA formatting, specifically focusing on formatting and text citations. As budding researchers and writers, mastering this style is key to giving credit and ensuring academic integrity. An in-text citation provides a brief reference within your text pointing to the source of your information. In the MLA format, in-text citations typically include the author's last name and the page number where the information was taken from. For example, Shakespeare's plays often explored the human condition, Shakespeare 23. Here, we're referencing Shakespeare's work found on page 23. Notice the absence of commas or other punctuation between the author's name and the page number in the parentheses. But what if the source has no identifiable author? No worries. For such cases, use a shortened version of the title in place of the author's name. Always make sure the title is in quotation marks. For instance, if you're citing a source titled, The Wonders of Nature, Nature has a way of showcasing beauty in the smallest details. Wonders of Nature, 45. In situations where you have more than one work by the same author, include a shortened version of the title of the particular work you're referencing. This helps clarify which work you're citing. Shakespeare delves deep into the intricacies of love in both Romeo and Juliet, 45, and Othello, 78. For works with two authors, include both their last names in the citation, connected by, and. Research suggests that learning styles vary greatly among individuals, Smith and Jones, 89. For works with three or more authors, use the first author's last name followed by, et al. The impact of climate change is profound and far-reaching, Brown et al., 303. And there we have it. A crash course on MLA in text citations. With consistent practice, this will soon become second nature for you. Remember, proper citations not only give credit to the original authors but also lend credibility to your work. Happy writing! And until next time, keep mastering the art of academic writing.